I should proceed with caution But my heart said go ahead and make a bid on that And I said hey pretty lady won't you give me some money for tripping But trip is what I do And one of these days I'm gonna get dressed and trip all over you I'm that fly young nigga Lil baby can't you see Your style is old my fashion coat tell me She don't see her perfect she don't Don't go to church on And ropers give it their best We'll show them how loud the hometown crowd can get Cause tonight y'all We all got a little bit of cowboy deep inside Welcome to the show, welcome to the home Of the world's biggest rodeo Where the stars light up Sitten ja me mentiin sitten itse asiassa samaan aikaan Mane ja on Torsti ja Moulin kanssa. Mooli on siitä vähän erikoinen tässä irtohypytyksessä, että se uh. siis itse juoksee tuota Maneesia ympäri, tai siis tietenkin mä ajo raipalla yeah. ohjailen sitä, mutta se itse siis menee tuonne kujaan ja hyppää noin esteet ja pikkasen annetaan sille sitten tuossa matkan varrella vähän kyllä raipalla vauhtia. Tässä oli vähän hankalaa saada toi viimeinen väli semmoiseksi sopivaksi, että Moulin olisi helppo siitä mennä, uh. niin sitä sitten pidenneltiin ja lyhennettiin väliä. Easy come and easy go And it wouldn't So anytime I bleed you let me go Yeah, anytime I feel you got me No, anytime I see you let me know But the plan and see just let me go I'm on my knees when I'm begging Cause I don't wanna lose you Hey, yeah Disrespect your surroundings Right here See that? Right there. That's the comment I've been looking for. I think that your ass gets outwitted. That's a lot of having to do with training horses and training mules and everything else. I think these horses are bred. They're a little bit smarter, and I have noticed they're smarter. And if you learn how to teach them the right way, they will cure you so much further. Just like a dang old mule. And don't say I don't know mules because right there, there's my two right there. But, uh, yeah. Show me your fast ride with your mule versus now. Damn stick, Flynn. You are my honey bun, sugar plum, pumpy and pumpkin. You are my sweetie pie. You are my cupcake gum drop, snickums, bookums. You are born to know that will always be right here. And I love. What happened to you? I lost my best friend. I'm sorry. Don't leave me. I want you here with me I know that 
Your love is gone hey, Yeah, we fancy like Applebee's on a date night Got that bourbon street stay with the Oreo shake And some whipped cream on the top two Two straws, one check, girl, I got you Bougie like Natty in the style why you shouldn't be anxious about riding a Grand Canyon mule, either around the rim or all the way down to the bottom of Phantom Ranch. First of all, mules are steady and very sure-footed, more sure-footed than their equine counterparts. They take small, dainty, sure-footed steps and always step with their rear foot exactly where their front foot had been leaving less room for slipping errors. Mules also don't spook easily. They can see 360 degrees around them, and so nothing spooks them. Even if they do get spooked, they don't have a flight instinct like horses have. Mules will just stand still and refuse to move forward if they get scared. Mules also have an insurmountable self-preservation instinct, and so they will never do anything or go anywhere that they think is a danger to themselves or their riders. Lastly, mules are fighters. Unlike horses, they can kick sideways like cattle, meaning they are much more able to defend themselves. My friend who works at the canyon once told me that a Took my first breath where the muddy grasses spills into the Gulf of Mexico where the skyline's colored <laughs> her to weave away from me and then to simply return to me she decided to return by backing up giving them choices allows them to offer some amazing things Play ball so we could ruin them. Mama said that it was okay. Mama said that it was right, all right. I kind of. I never really thought that Francis would make it this far with groundwork, much less being able to show at the national level and then take a freaking championship in the in hand division. When I got her, she was full of anxiety. She was pushy. She was rude. She would bolt right out of your hand, and she was just not fun to mess with on the ground. And honestly, prior to getting into AHCA, I wasn't that big of a groundwork person. Like growing up, I was made to do the halter classes. I didn't like halter classes. I felt like it was dumb and boring. But this, this really challenged me. They can say, they can say we've lost our minds. I don't care, I don't care if they call us crazy. Run away to a world that we desire Every night I lie in bed The brightest colors fill my 